regardless as to whether or not I'm carrying a larger pistol in a holster on my chest or in a shoulder holster or whatever, I've always got a pistol in my pocket. I've got a standard pocket load that all of my pockets get the same thing in them every day. I recommend you do that so you're never fishing around for anything. I've got my flashlight in the same position. I've got a, a clip knife in the same position on my pocket and I've got a pocket holster with a pistol and I've got a, a double mag pouch on the other side. I carry in my back pocket. I used to carry in my front pocket but uh, I found that it's easier for me whether seated or upright to get to a pistol in my back pocket. It's just whatever you prefer to do. I highly recommend that you carry a pocket pistol in a pocket holster. I didn't always do that but my friend Rob Leahy at Simply Rugged Holsters convinced me that that's the way to do for two reasons. First of all it helps prevent you from printing the gun through your pocket so it's not as obvious that you're carrying. Secondly and most importantly a pocket holster gives you the consistent position of the gun. Every time you reach back there the gun's in the same spot and you're ready to draw it. Um, it's never tumbling around in there. The butt is always in the same position all the time. You never have to fumble with anything. A good pocket holster like this one from Simply Rugged Holsters. This is their pocket protector. It, uh, it's a suede out holster. It works wonderfully. It, it, uh, the suede helps grab the pocket and also the sharp point here on the front of it helps grab the pocket so that you don't pull the holster out with the gun on the draw, which is a really an important thing to do because if you draw the, the gun with the holster still on it, you may not have time to pluck that thing off of there before you have to go to work. The pocket protector from Simply Rugged is a wonderful way to carry these. My everyday carry in my pocket holster since they've come out is the Ruger Max 9. I'm now carrying the Max 9 Pro. As soon as they came out, I went to it. It's a wonderful 9mm pistol. It holds plenty of ammo. It works wonderfully in the pockets. Plenty of room in there, even if you want an optic on it. You can put an optic on there. If you're wearing overalls, you've got a pretty big pocket. you got room for whatever you want to in there. On the off side, I've got a uh, matching suede out double mag pouch also from Rob Leahy at Simply Rugged Holsters and it also is really easy to draw a spare mag out of there, slam it home when you need to go to work with that. Another thing that I do that I've been developing for a while, both on the, on the holster side and on the mag pouch side, is I carry the mag pouch or the holster for the gun behind a folded up bandana that does two things for me. First of all, it further helps hide the fact that I'm carrying that by breaking it up in my pocket. It looks like I'm just carrying a bandana back there. Second of all, if I need a bandana for whatever purpose, I've got two of them. So if I have run into a friend that's crying for something, I can give them a clean bandana, not have to worry about not having one for later. Simply Rugged Holsters also makes a pocket protector holster for a J-Frame Smith. I carry a J-Frame Smith quite a bit also. This one happens to be my wife's Model 642 Smith, hence the pink laser grips. And the uh, pocket protector for the J-Frame has got a little slot here in the front that carries a couple extra rounds just in case you need to top off your reload. Again, it's a great holster and a great way to carry a concealed handgun. Another great pocket holster is the skin tight holster from the folks at concealedcarry.com. I've got, I'm carrying in this a uh, Springfield Armory Ronin EMP 9mm, 3 inch, little lightweight 9mm, really cool little 1911 style 9mm pistol. It works just wonderfully in this holster. And this holster is made to fit a small auto and it works for a wide variety of them. I've, I've carried everything in this from the Max 9 to the, uh, from the, to the little diamond backs. I've even carried the Bond Arms in the uh, pistol in this and uh, it works just wonderfully for the EMP. They, they are constructed of a little shell of Kydex, which is basically just a little can clamshell folded over a very thin Kydex. And the outside of it has, has a rubber coating, a rubber sleeve around all the sides and the bottom. That gives you spring tension to hold 
the gun into the holster gives you just enough spring tension to hold it in but it also the rubber grabs onto your pocket so when you go to pull the gun you don't pull the holster also these these are only about 25 bucks are available from concealedcarry.com they fit a wide variety of pistols and they work just wonderfully This barrel is stiff, it's rigid, it's fluted to lighten a little bit, it's black and stainless. So, you know, it don't have to be chrome lined and all that stuff uh, for durability. It'll last you a long time. These guns are extremely accurate, these two rifles are. Got a flat top on them. They don't have any uh, rails and stuff to hang up on stuff. They're real comfortable to shoot. Got a, a free floated uh, carbon fiber handgun on, uh, handguard on it. Well, crap. Let me start over then.